So in the first part of the question, we're required to find the gradient of the line L. Now the gradient of a straight line can be found by looking at the movement between two points, comparing how far we move up or down to how far we move across. So if I'm going from this point to this point, then I've gone down two and I've gone across four. So this will give me a gradient of minus two over four which equals minus one half. Now for the second uh, part of this question, we're told that another line L is uh, M rather is parallel to L. So if it's parallel, we know that its gradient is the same. Now the general equation of a straight line is y equals ax plus c. And we know that it's parallel, so its gradient is going to be minus a half x, because we've already worked out the gradient of the line L. Now we've been given a point which is the point uh, 6, 2. And uh, the point 6, 2 can now be substituted into this to help us find C. So 2 will equal minus a half x um, plus, well, actually we'll get rid of that x because we know the x is equal to 6. So 2 will equal minus a half times 6 plus C. So that's 2 equals minus a half times 6 is minus 3 plus c. We take the minus 3 to the other side, that will give me 2 plus 3, so it will give me c equals 5. So the minus 3 goes to the other side, becomes plus 3, plus 2 gives me 5. So the equation then of m is y equals minus a half x plus 5.